Okay, so now I'm going to talk to you about filtering things. And we've got our um, solution with our suspension of magnesium sulfate that we want to filter. Works for filtering anything else. Simplest method is gravity filtration. So you just need a conical flask and filter funnel. Now, people can be very lazy about this and attempt to just simply fold the filter paper in half and then in half again and then try and open it out and drop that in the funnel and then pour. The problem with this is that the surface area of the filter paper is actually comparatively small, it's just the outside area there and once that gets wet with the solvent and is in contact with the glass it actually forms a seal and so therefore you only actually end up filtering from this part here because all this is wetted and you're not properly filtering. So you only filter from here, it's incredibly slow and it's easy to get it blocked. Which is where you need to learn how to flute a filter paper. So fluting a filter paper is actually quite easy. Take your filter paper and fold it in half. Open it out and fold it in half again matching up those folds. So you now have an X all going into the centre. And then you're going to take that and fold each one of those in half again. So now we fold it over that way and we've bisected that part and then we fold it over again. And the, these folds are all in the same direction. So now you should have eight folds all in the same way and in order to get the fluted part you're now going to turn it over and you take two parts match up the folds over here and then press the fold and so now we've bisected those two folds and then you're going to repeat that all the way around with each one of those eight previous folds, you're going to bisect them, and so now you have 16 folds. And then the last one here. And so now all our folds are going in opposite directions. We give them a crimp and they'll move in. And so now we can take it place it in our filter and now you see that it keeps those bits of the filter paper off the sides just need to hold it in place slightly until it's wet and filled with your hands but now we're now filtering from every single one of those folds so each one of those bits because it's been kept off the glass it now is another surface for the solvent to move through and so when you pour your liquid in it will filter much faster, be much quicker and easier for you. And now we can filter off the magnesium sulphate. It's good just to make sure it's nicely swirled, to keep it loose. So that's gone through pretty quick compared if you tried to use that method.
and if you need to, just to make sure, you can then take a little bit more solvent, rinse with this, and pour it through as well. It's done. So that's the first type of filtration you can do.